as humans always want everyone to like us everyone to respect us but the reality is we see around us people don't like us for example if you post any photo of your new car or post photo of your new bike or photo of your vacation you don't get that much of likes which you anticipate same thing is true with some videos also suppose you are a youtuber like me and you post a video and you don't get that much of likes and then we get hurt we feel sad or maybe you are wearing a new dress and you expect that your friends will appreciate you but that doesn't come now this is a big problem which we face in everyday life i will help you out to handle this emotional problem so that you don't become a slave emotional slave of others be careful watch this video till end and i'm sure that this video will help you immensely because this problem is everyone's problem come on come with me and let us understand the psychology behind like and dislike Dear friends, what happens is uh, we want everyone to like us. It's very natural. There is nothing wrong in that. I also love that people like my video. Well, you can also like my video, this video. But first of all, watch the video and then you can like. Well, what happens? I have seen that in even my case also, when I post a video, and the video is of ten minutes, in the first thirty seconds they dislike the video without watching the video. well that also concerns me i also feel bad about that because without watching the video you are disliking the video now what happens is if someone dislikes you you get disturbed and someone likes you you feel happy now where is the locus of control the locus of control is outside you who is controlling you who is controlling your emotions someone else is controlling your emotions so you have become a a perpetual puppet in the hands of others your emotional control is in the hands of others and they are controlling you would you like to have that of course not so understand the psychology behind this and i will help you out to come out of this understand this point why people dislike you i'll tell you about that well actually the fact is there is nothing wrong with you there is nothing wrong with your uh, dress or nothing wrong with your youtube video or nothing wrong in you people dislike you because it is not your problem it is their problem problem is on their side what's the problem these people who dislike you are disturbed people these people who dislike you they have some inferiority complex in them they have some low self esteem in them this low self esteem inferiority complex stems out from childhood in childhood such people are abused criticized by parents by their friends by their teachers and these people develop this negative self image therefore they cannot handle if someone is doing better if someone is improving they get jealous well if something you accept that becomes inspiration but something which you don't accept yes. becomes jealousy what i mean is if you don't accept your friend's success it becomes jealousy but if you accept your friend's success your neighbor's success it becomes inspiration now this is about other people they have their own problems now here the question is how to come out of this watch carefully now see here to come out of this you have to change certain negative beliefs certain negative patterns or such certain hurtful patterns of thinking which are those well see i have told you many times that you can't carpet the whole world you have to wear shoes because you can't change the whole world you have to change yourself how to change that first of all change your beliefs which first belief we have we believe that all must like me 
or most of the people must like me they must respect me they must love me here let me explain you this 33.3% law see what is the reality the reality is 33.3% people hate you 33.3% people like you and 33.3% people have no interest in you this is the reality i mean i'm not saying that exactly that percentage but the fact of the matter is people will dislike you and there are many people in this world who dislike you many be many many of my uh, comments are there they don't like me they give a negative comment and i accept it because well tell me any person in the world who is liked by everyone tell me that there is no one in this world who is liked by everyone someone dislikes that person no matter how good that person is i have seen dislikes for sachin tendulkar's video i am his fan such a great player people dislike him so there are many uh, beliefs pattern of thinking everyone has they have their own ways of thinking so all must like you not going to work now people who are who dislike you they also have their own problems they are emotionally disturbed as i said before now you must practice empathy you must try to understand that the person who dislikes you or is angry with you is emotionally disturbed for whatever the reason may be so instead of getting angry try to support him be compassionate well he may help you and he may like you also in future so try to understand that the person in front of you may be emotionally disturbed due to various reasons okay now another thing is there well another thing is there that everyone has the right to like or dislike and they have the right to express that well you also dislike some people even they may be good for others but for you they are bad in the same way in the same token others also have the right to dislike to dislike you or to dislike people you like so they have the right to express their feelings they have the right to tell that they don't like accept that if they don't like you they have the right not to like you it is not mandatory that everyone must like you third point next point this point is very important and last point well at the end of the day if you like yourself if you accept yourself as you are with achievements and without achievements you don't need any external person any outsider to like you because you like yourself and that's all that is what really matters at the end of your day what people think about you is not important what you think about yourself is more important and that is what i keep on telling myself that when i make a video at the end of the day how many people like or dislike is not important but how i have made the video have i given my 100% in that video that really matters me but if i keep on thinking about how many people have liked my video how many people have disliked my video then i will be focusing on those factors which i can't control and i'm not focusing on those factors which i can control which is making good videos so dear friends if people dislike you it's very normal it's natural but one more thing is there people also dislike those people who are growing who are improving who are doing better so it's also a sign that you are growing and you are improving change your beliefs which i told you adopt new and healthy beliefs you will enjoy your success and you will also live with a person whom you don't like thanks for watching the video if possible like my video thanks a lot goodbye